to lower the bridge to access the walkway. I'll bring the lift down when you make it. The access panel is on the opposite side of the tower to the bridge. goes by where I don't wish I was you. Even with all that God knows what hardware, wetware, Seth mutation bullshit going on under that skin of yours, I take it. Come on. Cell had me locked down here for months. Never knew how far they were taking this shit.
It would have been just a matter of time before they put me into one of these things. Because that's what the Nana suit is, right? A Seth exoskeleton. I'm gonna make you fucking pay! You bastards! Where the fuck are you? Psycho. If I could find the cell bastard who did this, I'd fucking kill him. Come on. are cleared. I'm registering critical neurological changes. We should be able to make a clear link with the Ceph now. 
What's this? Michael, you shouldn't. Don't. Why not? It won't help. Operation. The nano suit is then fully removed. Subject 8A, Sergeant Michael Sykes, is, uh, is still functioning at near optimal levels, but accelerated degradation is to be expected. You. You did this to me. Michael, please listen to me. You are the reason why. I, I mean, I fight Cell because of you. Because... Is that why you cared? Or were you pretending to care because of this? Because of your own fucking guilt? I didn't have a choice, Michael! The cell program, we were in debt, you know how this works. I was forced to do this. To all of those people. I had to listen to their screams day after day after day. I know what I did. Jesus, believe me, I know. And I'll have to carry that with me as long as I live. Every day of my life. Michael! And feeling bad about it makes it all right, does it? If you're so fucking sorry, Claire, how come I had to find out like this? Why didn't you just come clean, you lying Cypher, fuck? listen to me. You know how it works. You know she didn't have a choice. She did what she had to do. No choice. Just doing what she's told. Just following orders. Who the fuck does that sound like, Prophet? I'll tell you one thing, though. She was right about you. You might as well be a fucking machine because you sure as hell ain't no human being anymore. I mean, you never were much good at it to begin with, but Jesus Christ, look at you now! Whose face are you wearing under that helmet these days, Prophet? Do you even have a face anymore? We all had to make sacrifices. You had a choice, mate. Everyone has a choice. But I told you everything you needed to know. Remember these. All the men who died under your command because you were just following orders. Because you had no choice. Just like her. Say no, mate. Take that suit of yours, and you go fight your own battles. <laughs> like always. Mike! Wait. No, Claire. He's right. Let him go.